I've been eating Mexican food all day. Happy Cinco de Mayo, May 5th of 2016. And, uh, yeah, literally, I've been eating Mexican food all day. I have, like, for breakfast, um, I had Taco Bell. And for dinner, oh, shit, don't let me get, I mean, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Don't let me get started with Taco Bell, guys. I had a Mexican pizza and a quesadilla, uh, a quesadilla. And I've never tried the quesadilla ever in my life, so I had to try it my first time. And it was pretty okay, but then my stomach, like, right when I was about to drive, when I was driving, I started, like, I felt like I wanted to throw up. I was like, Ugh. But I couldn't throw up, and I had to run. I just had Taco Bell in my system. But then, for lunch, I had something a little bit higher up. I had a chipotle. I had order the burrito bowl. This is a chipotle loophole, guys. Order a burrito bowl, double the rice, ask for six soft taco tortillas, and, um... I tried hoping for getting more meat, but maybe I should have gone half and half, like went, it's, because last time I got way bigger, way bigger portion, I, but I got nine soft taco tortillas because it only takes nine for me to get filled up, maybe eight, get eight actually, and this guy started asking me questions, like, dude, why couldn't you get the burrito? I literally told him, Chipotle loophole, check out the video on YouTube, and so yeah. I'd act, actually, I'd highly recommend for any of you who wants to go to Chipotle, who wants the bang for the buck, get the Chipotle, go get the Chipotle loophole, what I'm talking about right now. Though they, they feel no obligation to give you more meat if you ask for more rice in the, in the burrito bowl. Plus, you get more out of the burrito bowl than you do out of the actual burrito. The, most of the calories out of the burrito, basically, is from the tortilla. But you can get a soft taco tortillas, they'll warm it up for you, wrap it up, boom! You're making your own tacos, so you just eat and repeat, eat and repeat. And yup, guacamole, oh man. Nothing better than a chipotle guacamole. And for my celebration with you guys, I uh, my gramps gave me this, because they're also eating dinner. This is my dinner, but I'm full already. I'm, I'm, I just like literally came back from chipotle. So, oh, oh no, oh no, I got some tomatoes on my, I don't even know how to wrap this up to begin with. Oh, oh, and my shell is broken. Mmm, mmm, just like the One Piece chapter. Mmm, <laughs> let alone the Bleach chapter and the and the Nar Boruto chapter. Mm. Mm. I need some sauce with this. I need some hot sauce or something. I should have grabbed some more sauces from Taco Bell. Mm. 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 Tastes too dry, but. Mm. I actually like Taco Time better than Taco Bell. To me, it tastes better in my stomach, even though it's more deep fried, but it's cheaper too. Taco Tuesday, you can get a shitload of these. You can get a shitload of these, man. Tons. All kinds of games from a taco. Mm. 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 And just to let you guys know, I'm not Mexican. I may look like I'm Mexican, but I'm not. A lot of people confuse me with that. I'm actually some I'm Pacific Islander mixed with Asian and white. So yeah, I'm three rich. I'm like a an orgy mix. Okay. I'm related to the Rock. He's my uncle. Wayne the Rock Johnson. If you smell what the taco is cooking, pet taco Bennett. You know that I might might download those songs. Mm. Nothing better than to watch a grown ass man eating tacos in front of your faces. Nothing better. Mm. I'm wearing a straw hat from One Piece to make it look like a quinceanera hat. One of those, you know, one of those hats where they celebrate with Mexican. I need all I need is the ponchos. I'd be like, but I got a taco, so I'm like, 
Tastes like a Latina booty. Nah, I'm joking. Um, um, maybe. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I should have put some tapatio on there. Maybe, maybe that would have been that would have um, redeemed the hot sauce. But yeah. Um. That's all I wanted to show you. That's all I wanted to talk to you guys about. Basically, is just about you know living, living. Living the dream. If you guys need to recommend a book, I'd recommend reading. <sighs> Get into network marketing, guys. I finished reading this, Swordless Samurai. Finished reading How to Win Friends and Influence People. And I also went, finished reading Social Marketing, No Money, No Experience, No Problems, How to Make It Big by Cliff Braun. But now I'm currently reading a book called The Slight Edge, and I'd highly recommend you all get into that book. Network marketing is the key to success, everyone. Also listen to Jim Rohn, listen to these people, listen to Julian Doan, listen to Timothy Hur, listen to Cliff Brom, listen to Jeff Olson. They will grant you life success, and listen to Dale Carnegie too. Just listen to as many personal development it is, and you'll become the most successful guys out there, like El Chapo Guzman. <laughs> Um, but yeah, you go ahead, you drop me a like, you subscribe, this is JJ D. Uchiha, and you all have a fantastic week.